I'm sharing my sacred smudge bowl today. Block Claw Queenie. It's my white sage that I have. It was given to me um, years ago by some dear friends. My sacred abalone shell that I've had for over 20 years. That was a gift. I have sweet grass. That was a gift to me. I have my eagle feather. That was a gift to me. I have devil's club. That was harvested by Wayne. Very dangerous to harvest, but it is our power, our sacred medicine for protection. My beautiful deer horn. I am making as a drumstick, but I just keep it with me because I love the deer and the life that it brings our people for the food and the drum. So this is sacred to our people and me. And the cedar bark rose to symbolize all of our ancestors, grandmothers, grandfathers who have walked here before us. Where the roses never fade. This is why I have the rose with me at all times. Because my, my grandmothers and grandfathers give me strength. So I share this with you. My medicine that I am chewing right now. I chew the cleanse. It's called guacamine. It looks like sunflower seeds, if you can see. Our power and our strength, the guacamine seed. We harvest in September, and as the medicine grows, we eat um, early spring. Now they've flowered, so now we wait for September, October to harvest the seeds for them, and that's what we smudge with also and pray. And I chew, and it cleanses our bodies and it cleanses our spirits anything no negativity allowed so this is our sacred medicine and we also make tea out of it guacamine tea it's called and that's what that looks like so I put that medicine in my smudge bowl and I say sacred prayers for all my friends family all my brothers and sisters on Facebook. I pray for everyone, the animal kingdom, globally, all the animals of every country. Cedar boughs, we burn our cedar boughs. Cedar is our power. We make our clothes out of it, our capes, our headdresses, our blankets, our shoes, even diapers, um, moon time, a woman's personals. Um, was used for the bathroom, for the baby baskets, our homes. Secret, tr the seat, the sacred cedar tree is our, our life giver, and I include it in my smudge daily. I share with you. So, with a pure heart, you come before Creator and say, "Thank you, my Creator. Thank you for this beautiful day that you have blessed me with. This beautiful forest." Well, the forest that still stands here, we're praying for to be saved forever for our grandchildren for the next hundred generations. We pray and we come in love because we trust you, great creator, for saving our forest, for saving our families to come to the good red road. Pray for our brothers and sisters of every tribe and nation of sacred mother earth that they will come to know you and love you. They will be drawn to nature, to the waters, to the waterfalls, to the rivers, to the lakes, to the oceans. Where we leave our negativity, our pains and sorrows, we leave it there and let it wash. The water washes us and cleanses us and makes us strong to go on our lives on a good red road. To stay on our cultural walk in the good red road. I thank you and I honor you, great creator, for my family, for my sisters, for my brothers, for my three children that I love so dearly. And I pray every day 
that they will come and, and walk with me and the sacred waterfalls and drum and sing with me is my prayer, great creator. And I share with you because I love you, my brothers and sisters. And as I light my sage, my white sage, which is my favorite, this is my favorite smudge of all. And it's a beautiful thing to do every day to cleanse your house, to cleanse your car, to cleanse your heart, mind, body, soul, and spirit. Every tribe uses different medicine. I just share my medicine with you. It helps me to go on with our daily lives and and staying traditional and eating traditional foods. We eat salmon, we eat smoked fish, we eat elk meat, we eat deer meat. We eat so much of Mother Earth, the clams, the oysters. We eat everything. I'm sorry about the cars going by. But this is where I'm just doing the prayer right now because we're just in Rock Bay. But this is our smudge and I smudge Rock Bay today for all the animals, the bears, the cougars that we've seen, the beautiful baby owl that we've seen, 24 owls that we've seen, the hawks, hummingbirds that have come to me. We pray for all of them. Thank you, my great creator. And I love you with all my heart, as I love my friends in the whole wide world. I pray to you today, and I thank you and I honor you for our sacred medicines. This is the eagle feather that we use to fit the smoke around, and you can smudge your family, your friends. You can smudge, like I said, everything. And so to smudge yourself, you just use your hands and cover your face and your arms. Cleanse me, please, Creator. Fill me with more love, more healing to bring to everyone that wants to heal and know you. Thank you. Bless our cedar bark. I bless my drum. I bless my feathers. I bless my family. And this is our sacred smudge. Sacred prayers to you, great Gigamea. Love you with all my heart. I love you. I love you. Thank you, great Gigamea. We love you. Thank you.